so much for my day out at Chambers Lake. And now to find a plan B. That is not good. That wind is really blowing. This sucks. Way too dry in Colorado right now. I guess this just started just a few minutes ago. There's the smoke plume. Colorado is too dry. Wow. This fire is literally coming right over the mountaintop right now. coming over the top side of the hill there. <sighs> so a wildfire literally exploded out here at Chambers Lake not that long ago. And it is moving fast. I'm not sure that Chambers Lake is ever gonna be the same after this one. It's windy, there's a ton of beetle kill pine trees up there. It is hot. Oh, this is not a good situation. Wow. It's tragic. come rolling right down this mountainside here. They are evacuating all the campers for good reason. This thing isn't that far away. That is some high alpine terrain there. That is not going to be easy to contain. This may be the last time we see Chambers Lake looking like this. You can see the flames on that northwest flank of that hill there. Here's a bit closer up, you can probably see the flames. It is a towering inferno, unbelievable. view to kind of give you the scope of things here. Like I said, the campground's being evacuated. This thing is kind of on a direct path to head Chambers Lake Campground here. Guys are getting their boat out of the water in a hurry. Everyone is packing up the 
other side. Here's another view of the fire from the west side of Cameron Pass. This fire is getting bigger by the minute. One more angle of the fire here. You can see that huge plume of smoke up there. Doesn't look like it's getting any smaller, that's for sure. Boy, I hope they can contain it. Hey guys, this has been a day like no other. I was coming up for a beautiful day of fishing at Chambers Lake, and as I pulled into the parking lot, I saw a small wildfire way off in the distance grow into a very large wildfire coming right at Chambers Lake. I've never seen anything like that before. It was wild. I got my camera out, took some quick video, and just kind of sat there in awe watching this thing grow like exponentially and then decided I got to get out of here uh, before they close this place down. So I drove down to the town of Walden and kind of recalibrated, tried to figure out, well, what am I gonna do with my uh, night and tomorrow with fishing? Well, I found a great lake here and I'm super excited to fish it tomorrow, but I just can't get over um, what a surreal moment that was, watching that fire just explode right in front of me. Um, I've never seen anything like it and probably never will again, at least I hope so. Uh, here's to hoping that it gets contained quickly, everyone gets out of there safely, and um, we get some rain here in Colorado. It is way too dry. I love this state, and it breaks my heart to see that happening in our great state of Colorado.